it up. It hurts, it's sore. Breakfast is served. Talking about I might not be able to leave until nine o'clock today. What? I can take my seatbelt off, but I'm I'm fucked now. <clears throat> my water broke. Water broke. Water broke. Water broke. Water broke. I got no contractions. I'm not feeling nothing. Like I'm good. Like nothing. Nothing happened over here. No. No pain. Nothing. So just taking my time, cause what's gonna happen is I'm just gonna sit in there for 14 hours. Waiting on the baby to come and waiting gets the my 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 you know to get dilated. So what's the point of rushing to the hospital? Oh, we just moved in. Boy, oh, cleaning it out out. To him. I'm gonna tell I'm gonna tell Benny and, uh, uh, Benny and Bree you ain't do this for them. <laughs> I did. You probably did. This is the cutest I've been going to the hospital. We don't look like this. I'm gonna change. You can use. It'd be pointless for us to say the same every single time. Right. That means every year we haven't done nothing different. Mm. So for the myth, people think just as soon as your water breaks, you're in pain. You gotta go straight there. Uh uh. It's been what an hour? What time is it? My stomach itches up. Mm. Mm -hmm. Back it up. Ooh, look at that. Back it up. Ooh. We got a lot to do still. I'm not gonna go straight to the hospital. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Got the bed, sheets washing. Got the humidifier going. The power of prayer. <laughs> uh, her bassinet is still in the garage, but she gonna go right here. That bassinet gonna fit right here. Another baby. Put my mask on. My heartbeat is loud. Can't see it. But that's over there. Got my IV in. It's really cold. That bad boy right there. Checked in and all. I'm just waiting on that epidural. Because I want it. Look at these. These are all comfortable. These are the blue ones. If y'all y'all know what I'm talking about, the blue ones a little hard over some electric tension. Well, I hope my face makes me feel better, but it does. Y'all gonna have to forgive me. In this part of the video was supposed to be a vlog of me giving birth. The audio was just tripping. I'm sure you've probably, probably already experienced it. You may or may not be watching the vlog, having to turn your volume up, then turn it down and turn it up. I can't, it's, I don't know what happened with the audio, so. My apologies. That's when they insert the part that y'all missed. So after the contraction, the lady had came in 
and she just kept checking, you know, they had to get my blood drawn, all this extra stuff, yada, 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 right? We'll say around four, they noticed that that our baby blood pressure was uh, dropping, or no, I'm sorry, heart rate, heart rate. She tried to give me reasons on why this would be happening. Um, she didn't make it seem like it was a big concern. She was like, the umbilical cord could be around the baby's neck. It could be around their leg. He'd just be laying on them because I guess I lost a lot of, I lost a lot of my sac burst. And when your water breaks and ruptures, uh, it's pretty much all baby and no room for the baby to float. So they're saying the umbilical cord is not, is like, just laying on top of the baby some kind of way uncomfortably, which is causing the baby's heart to drop. This is what she's saying. She, she gave me like a peanut ball and I had to try different positions at first. She tried that for like an hour or so. <clears throat> or I laid on my side with the ball, then laid on my other side with the ball. After that, she kept coming in and wasn't working. Or she entered this tube where I guess on one side it's like, it's like on the, attached to the baby's head and then the uh, somehow it, basically they pump put water back inside me right it, i guess it was salt water that they put inside me because the goal is to make the book core float back up and put get the baby's heart rate back right back up up the pace so she tried that that didn't really work i'm gonna speed y'all up because clearly the baby's here she's healthy uh i ended up having to get on all like Fours. literally butt is in the air like it was I don't know what they were looking at but I was comfortable sat there for maybe like 20 minutes that worked I'm not gonna I'm not gonna make a dramatic pause that ended up working around four o'clock she checked me I was four no five centimeters I was five centimeters here we are around five ish at the end of five o'clock when I'm in the fetal position and when I'm in the you know the butt in the air position uh she checks me she says I'm pretty much complete Ball is rolling. They called my doctor. I looked over at Philip. Like, yo, it's time. He was on his phone playing pool. He was like, okay. It was two nurses, my husband, the doctor in front of me, right? Two and a half pushes, she was out. He goes, can you feel this? And I was like, uh, no. So he opens, like, he puts his hand in there more to hold the baby's head. Cause the nurse walked by, by the way, the nurse walked by, she was like, yeah, that's baby's head. He was like, we'll do a push for 10 seconds. You know, go. One, two, three, five, seven, nine, ten. Push it, right? In the middle of that push, the nurse is like, okay, go ahead and stop. You can breathe. My doctor was like, no, 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 no. I'll tell you, I'll tell you when to stop. And then I pushed one more time and baby girl was out. She came out weighing seven pounds and one ounce. And she was 20 inches long. She was my easiest go around pregnancy labor wise. I was literally admitted by, it's like three or four o'clock. And then I had the baby by 6.30. So, what? My other two kids took 14 hours. I was in there forever. Since my water broke, I was in the hospital just chilling this city. Yeah. I, I don't really talk about all this stuff later on, so. But yeah, she passed out a test, a hearing test. Um, the rest of all just me waiting, pretty much waiting to get uh, discharged. Because you have to be in the hospital, or at least the baby has been in the hospital for 24 hours. So because she was born Sunday at 6.30 p.m., we had to stay until at least, I should say, we just say we had to stay at least, is what they said, Monday, 6.30 p.m. And at that point, if she doesn't have jaundice and she passed all her other tests, then I could be discharged. But yeah, I caught you guys up. That's it. Enjoy the rest of the vlog. You should be picking up at the part where where uh, Philip was. He was spoiling her and ignoring me. So, there you go. What you want me for? Uh-uh. Go kiss your love. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Don't hang out with her. Don't mess around with me. Now I gotta fight with two girls. Mm-mm. You did good, baby. I do. So say hi, YouTube. What's up? I'll drop the camera before I drop her. Hello. You look so peaceful when you're sleepy. What are you dreaming about, mommy? As soon as he leaves, uh, someone's gonna, gonna move, I'm gonna get moved. Oh, yep, let's stop it right now. Uh, to move, like, yeah. to hold up stuff, and then yeah. buzz out as soon as yeah. you get comfy in there. Perfect. We're going to room 205. All right. It's on the same floor. It's just down the hall. I didn't even show y'all the room. This is the new room. Some light.
Got the baby right there, you know. Phil just got back. Supposedly got my in and out in here. Oh, wait, you didn't get in and out. I forgot you went to the hat. Got some water. Just ordered him some mommy cocktail because he's infatuated. This is my breakfast menu, baby. I didn't know there were fries like that. Right, wait, that wait, big? Wait, wait. Yeah. These are two large fries. Pick them up. Yeah, baby, Fill get it. The, you got oil. I didn't know. Put it back. This is how you know it's not good. <laughs> oh, baby, what? Mm -hmm. No, these are huge. No. They like ultra balls. Yeah, we could have shared these fries. They give you a lot. Oh wow, yeah. Let me see your um. See what you got over there. Oh yeah, you messed up. You supposed to eat this when you haven't ate all day. You know what I'm saying? You supposed to get this when you haven't ate all day. Look how huge this is. Hey, get the first bite so I can try it. I knew it. I knew you going somewhere you didn't have no business going to was going to be nasty. In and out. That's why you stick to what you know. This is my Oh, no. We talking about. We in, we in the postpartum. Amazing. What about it? Yeah, we, we, we'll be home tomorrow, though. Oh. Something that the back seat is big enough. Hey, can you wake it up? Can you wake it up? Can you wake it up? You ready to eat? You ready to eat? Oh, baby. Oh, yeah. Oh, I didn't want to baby. Yeah. I am so tired. It's 5.55 a.m. I haven't been able to get any sleep. I tried to do like little power cat naps, but I cannot sleep. This hurts. I can't wait to take this out. It really, really hurts. This is my little bathroom suite. I'm going to shower. Got my little sink and the toilet <laughs> and my little, you know, hey, hey. This is the bag. You know, they give you without your, without, without your goodies. But yeah, I'm ready for breakfast. I'm ready. My back hurts. By the way, that side, side effect of having an epidural. My legs are back functioning. I got access to those. That's just how I'm feeling right now. I didn't even tear. I didn't tear. I was able to. I was able to push without, you know, ripping. I had to get stitches. I should say. I never had to get stitches for both. Like all we did was help. This one was like the easiest. Two pushes, and she was out. Let me stop talking and get ready. I don't think I'm gonna change. I'm gonna keep wearing this until I know I'm gonna leave today. So I'm just gonna brush my teeth. She's at the gas station. She left a surprise for you. She's at the doodle tar. Oh, yeah. I, I already changed one like that. Black. Yeah. Looks pretty good. Got some Chick fil A. Mm hmm. And that's food. That's how you make fast food. Breakfast is served. I got something. I didn't even get a lot. Cause like I said, I didn't want to not eat it. I didn't want to waste their food. It's supposed to be like a blueberry muffin, I believe, right? This right here? It's an orange cinnamon, an orange cinnamon, French toast. French toast. There you go. Thanks, baby. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, I can eat that. Poor people. Poor people. This, <clears throat> this should be good. You can't go wrong with a blueberry. Blueberry. 
Blueberry's cool. That's cool. Is she over there asleep? Is she asleep or she look outside? She's, She's asleep. asleep now. Alright. We're talking about I might not be able to leave until 9 o'clock today. It's a whole other day. Not good. I'm trying to go about this afternoon. What am I going to do here all day? Nothing. Look, y'all. Y'all, look at my arm. <laughs> I'm bruised up. It hurts. It's sore. She drew my blood. But you, you did. It was better than last time, right? That's my whole thing. It's so far been a better experience than, than last time. Yeah, but last time was the worst. Last time was rough. <laughs> I was watching. I was praying when I used to give you a girl. Yeah, I, I see you over there. <laughs> did you see me? Yeah, he was fine. He did a great job. Yeah. Wiped it, stuck it, moved on. It is past lunchtime. I think I showed y'all what I got for lunch. If I didn't hear this real quick. Um, but here we are. A quick little snack. I said I was a little hungry. They had some ham and Swiss croissant. Looks amazing. Is it dry, baby? Is it good? It's dry. It's dry? You gotta put the mail on there. Yeah, I can't eat a dry sandwich, so yeah. Eat it with some chips. You want some of these chips? No, I'm gonna go with the chips. Got a couple graham crackers and a cute little mini soda. Look beat up. I wanna go. Bless you. I wanna go. You got the sneezy sneeze. The baby girl. Baby girl, what's your name? Can I talk to you? Can I buy you a drink? I mind me. You know me. Perry music, never boo. See, it ain't that bad. <laughs> it's a little baggy on you, but it's okay. Say so we gonna fill it out. We gonna fill it out. We gonna fill it out. Hey, we gonna fill it out. We gonna fill it out. Hey. She's gotta learn how to be still. Look at her. She's <laughs> miserable, baby. She's not miserable.